Hello everyone, welcome to Phasmophobia. So, since we're getting closer to Halloween, I decided that here on Nightmare, we're going to be doing two runs in a row. So, we're going to be playing here on Edgefield twice. So, I think this will be a good way to really learn Nightmare a bit faster, because I haven't been playing it too much, but I really am enjoying Nightmare, so... And also, as we get closer to Halloween, I do want to play a lot more. So, I'm gonna run through here, maybe look for the cursed item. Okay, so the cursed item wasn't around here, unless I just missed the mirror, which I usually would have seen that, just for no reason. Okay, breaker is in here, but no hiding spot. Now, something I want to mention as I'm noticing it, I actually turned up my settings for the game because I had turned it down because I thought the performance was bad, but now I got it turned up, so it's, the game is looking really nice, and apparently there's going to be even more optimizations. So, during the Halloween update, so, I don't know, I didn't realize the game, I didn't really have too much turned down, but I got it looking a lot better now. Oh, ooh, see? There's a little bit of something, and look, you led me to the bone. So, what I have been enjoying is this tier 3 thermometer. But we did just turn the breaker on, so I don't really know. I mean, if it's up to 10, it's pretty warm. But it seems the ghost is around here. This has been open. I wonder if you've been touching this. Okay, I don't want to trust the thermometer just yet. Now I'm gonna walk around. <sighs> that... Are you walking? See, I think you're like on the other side of the wall here. I thought you were down the stairs. What? Are you done? Now, I don't think that was Mare, and turned the light right back off, but that was because it was... ...doing the event. Okay, was that this door back here? I think it was this one. I'm gonna take a photo. So then... Oh my god, if that's not it... The... Whoa, I got stuck. So this... These rooms is always weird because... I feel like if the ghost is back here... ...they can touch like through the wall here so it was was that a that was one door touch but see but see okay no emf5 i want one photo please i probably could take two I, I, i'm glad i didn't i'm not even gonna try so this is where i was looking for a hiding spot and of course this is where the ghost is but i did see my breath so let me look at this See, that's what happens, though. I think the ghost can just interact through walls so much that it, it's interacting with stuff over there, even though this is its room. I don't think it's going to be in here. Oh, God, no, it's actually three degrees in here. Well, oh, see, it's touching stuff way over there again. Actually, unless it just touched the... I thought that door sounded like it was over there. Okay, one photo. Maybe now should be a good time to go look or a hiding spot maybe down in the basement but also what what inventory huh okay was that this one? Oh my god look here I don't want to be farming photos but I just I'd like to get them out of the way I really should get a UV in here for this but let me look for the voodoo doll right here which I wanted to see also that's not a hiding spot it just it's in the bathroom in there. I mean, this is a hiding spot, but that's not really that good. In here, I mean, this is not really a hiding spot. I'm gonna have to run downstairs. So I'm gonna leave the ghost. Let me... Who knows what my sanity is after all those ghost events. But there, I don't think there was a hiding spot back here. No. Let me check in the basement. And also, I did not find the cursed item. No, I didn't really look for the monkey paw. But it could be the... Summoning circle down here, which, good. I don't even know what the objectives are, <laughs> and it is photo, of course, so maybe we can get the objectives done, but man, I don't really have a hiding spot other than just, like, running all the way to the basement and hoping it doesn't check down there. Now, if I do the summoning circle, though, I can run back up to the top. Okay, let me get out of here. Okay, it's touching a door a lot. We'll get <laughs> that, and then a book and spirit box. Photo of the ghost, that should be free. And then hunting. Maybe I should get one in there because it's starting to drain my sanity. But what do I, well, I'm gonna leave the spirit box. Let's get one crucifix in there. 
Yeah, I still hear that shower on. Now luckily this should cover like almost everything. I'm gonna put it like right there and maybe it'll just cover almost the whole room really. And please let me turn that off. Oh my god, and this too. No, I, everything about this room is so glitched out. I'll take a dirty water photo. I don't want to take sanity, that's why I just got the crucifix in here. So if we're at hunt range, I might as well get that done. We're not going down to freezing. I really should have looked for this, but it was touching the door so much, I went ahead and grabbed this. Give us a sign. Heather Anderson, where are you? Oh god, I always forget <laughs> to go through everything. I go through one at a time, and <laughs> I should have just put that down sooner. Okay, oh, see, I knew we were at pretty low sanity, but I don't think that would have been an early hunt. Camera. Check these photos. Okay, not an Oni, but I'm really getting thrown different directions here. So, we got the burn crucifix. Save that one for the ghost photo. So there, no more photos. I'm glad I really realized that. I just wanted to fill the book up. Like, if I get a lot of interactions and opportunities for photos, I want to take them. So I'm going to leave you in here. Maybe I will go take Sanity. See, I, that door, that was one of these. And then there's the UV, okay. I'm not even going to try and figure out just yet. But we finally have something. Okay, I, I don't really want to use up that other crucifix, so let me go. I'm going to take like maybe one or two sanity pills. And then, well, yeah, just continue with the evidence. Because actually, the only thing left is the photo of the ghost. So let's figure out this other evidence and see what we can narrow it down to. Okay, I took two sanity and I'm coming back in with three more equipment. So I'm hoping I just get lucky here with finding, like, the ghost orbs as I walk in here. I am trying not to get- oh, see? There we go! But I'm trying not to get hunted. Right off the bat, at least. Okay, Banshee, Hantu, or Obake. It didn't get super cold. No, Obake. I should be looking for the fingerprints. Hmm. The problem is... I could test a banshee if it roams to me, like, by going all the way downstairs and then setting up some motion sensors, which that would be a fun way of testing it. But also, really, with the banshee, you can test it with the, uh, uh paramic. So what do I do here? <laughs> no reason for this, no reason for this. I don't need a photo. Uh, oh, wait, what? Did I grab two books? What is wrong with me? I thought I, oh, it doesn't matter. I got lucky with the ghost orbs. I, I felt like I should have had more than... <laughs> I thought I should have had room for the dots. Well, I really shouldn't just be standing in here then. Hantu we can tell from a hunt, and Obake, oh, it touched that again. So an Obake has a chance of not leaving fingerprints, but also it has the unique fingerprints. And also the Obake has the ability to shape shift during a hunt, so that's something we could look for during the hunt. I kind of want to see if, give us a sign, touch a door. I want to see if we get the six finger Obake fingerprint though, because that's going to be like the easiest way to tell. Come on, give us a sign. And it's the same ones though. It didn't change. Well, I guess. Do we just go ahead and get hunted? And then try and see if it's a Hantu or if it's normal speed? Because both Obake and Banshee are going to be normal speed. The Banshee will roam to me. So, okay, we should get hunted while I have the sanity to take. Maybe I'll still have, if I take two sanity bottles, maybe I'll be able to use the summoning circle because I still have to have like 85 sanity to use that, which I forget about. So let's go see about doing that. Maybe I'll end up getting killed, but if we do this, see, I'm not really going to have the sanity to be looking for a banshee, but let's just go get this uh, photo and we need to get a hunt anyway. I also want some of these lights on around here. Okay, well there goes all my sanity. I'm coming in here with three smudges. I have my camera at the door here, but I'm gonna put another smudge if I need it. But let me put that smudge like in here or something. I don't know if I'm gonna run through here or not. Now, the hiding spot, I'm gonna actually go upstairs and use that one in the closet. But, 
Oh, see, this is why... I want to turn on some lights, but I'm not going to. I'll turn on the lights down here. Now, I'm... <laughs> I think I have enough sanity to do this. <laughs> this does really look a lot better with its settings, though. Alright, got to the camera. I'm gonna hope I can get up here without the lights. And then, see, if it was... That's like normal speed, so it doesn't seem like it's a haunto. I should, yeah, not have that camera out, should I? I guess I'll get in here. It was normal speed, though. If it was in a warm room, I think it would be so uh, slow that it wouldn't even be able to get to me. And I, I mean, I kind of wanted to come back up here. <laughs> it looks like it's Obake or Banshee, and now... With all the fingerprints, we've not seen the other ones, and I think it has been leaving them every time. Unless that one time it touched the door and didn't change them, that could have counted as like a door touch, but really there's no way to test this other than going for the Banshee paramic sound. See, it really sucks because I have no sanity now. So, unfortunately, I kind of screwed this one up. I'm, I'm gonna, I don't, <laughs> wow, I don't have the resources. To really figure this out, I don't have the sanity. So, let me drop the camera. <laughs> it's, a, it's a shame, because we have such a good run otherwise. But it has been leaving fingerprints every time. So actually, I'm leaning towards it being Banshee. And we've not seen the extra fingerprint one. And all, all the different ones we've seen. Where are you? Oh my god, what? She's sticking her head out the wall. <laughs> Please, you're just... There's no reason for me to even... Oh my god. Let me into your closet. I don't... I think it's gonna be a banshee. Maybe I should leave? Okay. I think it is going to be banshee, though. There's nothing I can really do other than get... A... Yeah, okay, you know what. <laughs> there is things I can do. I can smudge, for one. So I think I... <laughs> it's hard to tell. Yeah, I got two smudges on me. I'm gonna go up there with another one of these. Go up there with the smudges, and I think I just brought the damn UV down here. Now please, let me get in here and smudge though. Are you hunting? Okay, I'm running in and smudging. You are smudged now. So now I have more time to look for... Oh, and also I'm putting this down. I wanna... What did I do with it? <laughs> See, I ran out here with it. I knew I took it out of the room. I'm looking for the fing extra fingerprint. And if we get a whole bunch more, we're going to just say it's a Banshee. I don't want to sit here with the, uh, Paramike and look for the Banshee scream, because it could take a while. And also, with it being so interactive-y and touchy, just with stuff. Where, why are some of these shadow events, like, bugged, unless you're really in there? I've not been seeing the ghosts a lot with these shadow events lately. I... Now are you in the bed? Look at this! Your head was sticking out of the bed. Okay. Yeah, it's cool of a light show we've... We're in, in the dark here with UV. Might as well keep it dark. Yeah, we have not gotten... Any time where it's not... Left one, but there was that time where it touched the door and then maybe it just left the same fingerprint? Like, I don't know if it'll... Have a chance of changing it. Wow, I really pissed off this ghost. I mean, you were active to begin with. I think it's just a banshee that really likes me, though. I think I've spent enough time here to figure out this is gonna not be... Cause I, like I said, I was saying I didn't have enough sanity, but I still have smudges and stuff to spend some time in here, so it, this is the one thing I think I can do other than sitting here with a pair of mic, which... I don't know. Since this could be Obake, you know. But I think... <laughs> Alright, since we're going to do no another game, and there's not much I can do other than just continue getting fingerprints here, I'm going to guess that it is Obake. Now, since it did that, let me see if it'll let me escape. I mean, yeah, let me get back to the stat screen. Oh, please. And, uh, we'll see if I was right. Yeah, okay. So, like I said, I could have, since I pretty much knew it was a Banshee, I could have sat there and used the Paramike, but I'm not going to even bother, even if it could have, even if it was probably a Banshee. Because it was touching everything from the beginning as an Obake, and Jesus Christ, a whole lot for this one. But like I said, I'm going to skip <laughs> level 69, but didn't unlock anything. But alright, that was kind of a shorter game, 
So there's another reason that it's good that we're going back in there. That one felt like a longer game, but maybe it's just because we found the ghost and kind of figured it out quickly, but I'm going to get back in there for round two. Okay, so the main thing about doing a game right back is sometimes I start thinking about what happened in the previous game. But I'm going to do my scan again. Go in with... on these. I'm still using my headlamp only on these small house maps. So what about the cursed item? Okay, I'll take a photo, but I'm going to be leaving that. Looks like it's awful foggy. Also, the fog seems to be broken out there. It's only like going through right there. Okay, breaker in the same spot. My favorite hiding spot is closed this time. Okay, well, I'm gonna be waiting for the temperature to go up, but I'm looking or listening for anything. Now, I, I think it's about like two minutes or so that you do have to wait, but I could be scanning just to see what the temperature is or so around here. I think under 10 is generally the... See, it's... <laughs> even with the breaker starting off, it's already pretty warm around here, isn't it? So it's funny that I'm really starting using the thermometer again. <laughs> the thing is, though, these other two rooms were 15, and then out here it's under 10 still, so maybe it's just this is a bigger room, so it's not as warmed up. But there's a door kind of ajar over here. Is anyone around here? See, it's awful warmer in these other rooms. I kind of want it to be downstairs. <laughs> All my hiding spots are up here. Okay, well, it's been cold, but I didn't hear anything. <laughs> All these hiding spots, man... Please don't let the ghost be around here this time. But look, it is so cold in this hallway, I guess. Is anyone here? I'm sitting in the dark just letting my sanity drain. Oh, I heard that. Was that over here? No, was that green bedroom like I thought? Oh no, that was... Oh, an EMF-5, maybe you really are a hallway ghost. Man, the t I really like the tier 3 thermo. I've been- I, it's been so long since I like really enjoyed using the thermo and now I like am. So photos... Okay, do not forget that EMF-5. That is a big start. <laughs> EMF-5 luck continues. So are you a hallway ghost? Oh, you definitely are considering it's staying cold in here. This could be a fun challenge though. Alright, I'm gonna bring in some more equipment that maybe suits a hallway. Okay, since we had so much UV luck last time, I want to get the UV in there again. I did just touch a door. Now, it's upstairs. I didn't see a hiding spot downstairs. I didn't go to the basement. You did not leave fingerprints unless they're already gone. Let's leave this out in the hallway and scan for orbs. Turn off my light. Oh, and then this one's on. So where would orbs be in this hallway? <laughs> there are going the curtains again. But no, I don't see anything around here. Give us a sign. I kind of do need it on a tripod, but I don't see anything, so... Where do I even put this? Oh god, I see, now I gotta look where I'm actually my cursor is. Well, <laughs> I'm gonna set this here. I, at least I have equipment around. Did I just see my breath? Or was that the dots? Man, it really is cold around here, and it did touch the uh, door, so it's pretty obvious it's going to be a hallway ghost. I mean, I could run in here and hide. I could smudge like on that side and then run in here and hide. I've not had a hallway ghost up here though, like maybe in like a long time or ever. Oh, come on now. That was rude. Okay. Turn light on. Check for that fingerprint, which we do not see. And then I already have EMF, so I guess I could take a photo. Which, ah, uh, whatever. <laughs> I'm glad you can take photos, because now you can just be a lot riskier and not feel too bad about it. And again, there is still a full photo rework coming eventually. We're not down to freezing yet. You did not like my camera, even though I didn't see any ghost orbs. Well, maybe let's leave this dots here. We'll get another dots for this section and we'll just start having dots going all over this area. Yeah, this is how my uh, sanity is something I should be worried about. But let's get more. Oh my god, see I, ah, I cannot keep track of my inventory. Let's throw this in at the door then. This is at least one good thing is that there's not a big distance here. 
I'm going to throw in more evidence and my sanity. So what do we got here? <laughs> Average sanity below, pair of mic, and then witness events. Well, not too hard. Okay, I don't know. I just grabbed more stuff. I grabbed two books and then two dots. So that way I'll have book over here and then a dots over here. And then throw this here. And then I'll grab the other stuff I tossed down, which, geez, I am so bad at inventory management right now. I think it's because I don't have my main light. So here, we got two books around here in case it wants to write. Oh, what are you doing? Touch the door. I'm not going to worry about the photo, but I will worry about this. Still not seeing it. God, I feel like this is the true ghost hunting experience with all these dots and stuff, trying to scan for the ghost in here. This is awesome. But when it comes to everything else, I mean, I could get a bear mic in here and sit. Let's get... I don't know. I want to add more to this, like salt and ghost or uh, motion sensors, so... I don't know. Give us a sign. That's the main problem here, is you're not really doing anything. Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you close? Are you far? Are you here? Are you close? Are you far? Are you here? Are you close? Are you far? Let me see if it's cold. I'm gonna leave that spirit box going. Let me see if it's cold in this room. And it's not. So you most certainly just do love this hallway. No fingerprints. So, let's see. If it was an obake, it would be a very good obake because it would be hiding all of its fingerprints. So, I don't think it's obake. That's the wrong thing here. Are you here? Oh, it's okay. Not that was an event because the door was wide open, and also I that seemed really strange. I guess it's just these dots are so loud. I might pause them. They look so cool, don't they? But I kind of want to pause them because they make so much noise. And also pausing them would definitely be better. Let me get down here and close it. Okay, good enough. I wanted to pause it. That might be a hunt. That's a hunt. Now please, I'm running to the basement. Seems a normal speed, by the way. You don't have this much time, dude, to be looking down here. Yeah, it's not even a cursed hunt, and he made it all the way down here. This is where I'm gonna have to hide. And just hope that, like, back here is, you know, far enough away. Well, uh, we know we're in hunt range, but I'm glad, glad to have that hunt. Because we <laughs> at least know it's normal speed. So get me out of here. So with EMF 5, knowing that it's normal speed, doesn't really seem like a shade. The breaker's on. I really just need to get the other evidence, but oh my god. Okay, since we need to get lower sanity, I'm gonna go in there with two crucifixes. I mean, we have all the evidence stuff in there. I didn't see the ghost orbs. Maybe we need salt to look for, <laughs> to make sure. I mean, we we know it's not UV. Let's go in with some smudges, or at least one. Man, it really just kind of sucks. Look at, let's, mm, let's get two crucifixes and a smudge in there. So kind of like a, These are some wild ghost events. Like, well, maybe it's because I was on the stairs, but that sound was something like I've never heard before. I'm gonna put this dead center, and then I'm gonna put this dead center kind of like at this corner, I guess. Now, if you had written, that would have been so good. Ooh, there's a lot of stuff thrown. Oh, but it can't be poltergeist. See, you've roamed into so many other rooms. You've given me dirty water in here. Let me make sure. Oh my god, freezing! See, having that in here the whole time, it finally got down to freezing. Now, I don't have to worry about turning that stuff off. Maybe I can just leave that one on. But for this game, I don't have the bone. We don't exactly know what it is. It, the two times it's done ghost events, it w didn't do the air ball, so it might be a Oni, and it was normal speed. That's the problem. 
Twins, I could tell, but oh god, how am I really gonna figure this one out? Not oh oh thank you, not Noni. <laughs> well, you helped me out a little bit. I guess I want to get the light back on. You are around here, but I have a crucifix. I ain't a smudge. Okay, I don't wanna wanna make sure that that book doesn't screw my photo over. Should I go? I mean, I, I made so much money last game. I'm at the point where I just want to, you know, I'm here for Nightmare right now, and I've made so much money. Let's focus on Nightmare. So it's Gin Shade or Twins. It really doesn't feel like shade. All I really can do is get hunted again. Okay. It's like it heard me, even though I wasn't talking. Tons of good photos. Since you're over here, and if you hunt from over there, I'm not going to be as mad, but if you hunt from over here, I'm definitely going to be mad. Well, I got lucky with the ghost orb event. Also, what? How do I not get EMF for that sometimes? I don't understand. It was- uh, This game is so confusing right now. That was an event. It must have been doing an event so far away because the door was open and I thought it was a hunt and I couldn't- I swear I couldn't turn on the light for a second there. Oh my god, but it was around there. I'm trying- I am trying to get another hunt, but it's probably just gonna do the crucifix again. See, it's- it's right there. Like, the hallway's- Still normal speed. Now the thing is, the breaker... The breaker has been on this whole time. I wish I had closed that properly. Now, I might use the music box, but there's really no reason to other than a photo, which I don't need. I really just want to focus on figuring out the ghost here. We need a few more hunts to see if it really is the twins faster, and it hasn't been interacting from far away, and I don't think it did the twins twice at the same time. It might just be a gin, and the thing about the gin is, the ability is that it won't turn off the breaker, and that's because when the breaker's on, it will, you know, be faster within a certain range, but then I don't even remember the range, but look, the breaker's off, so, oh my god, not a gin. Somehow things are actually panning out here. Oh, breaker is on, so why... Did I turn that light on and there- I turned the light switch on, didn't I? I'm doing my own thing now. Was it on? When I walked out here- maybe it was on when I walked through that door. I am- I am just psyching myself out now. If I can, since it's using crucifixes and stuff. I still do just want it to hunt some more, because the only thing I can really do is see if it's the twins. I'm gonna have to get hunted a few more times. And also, it's gonna be a good idea. Oh, Paramike. Screw the Paramike. We made 1800 last time. I'm not worried about getting the bone or a perfect game, so. Screw the camera as well. I want more smudges. And I'm gonna keep getting hunted, and then I might even use the. Mm, music box. I wanna call it the magic box. It's the music box, damn it. But I wanna use that. So we'll see. Because I, I wanna get uh, cursed hunts, so this way it'll last longer. But of course, if I don't actually have a hiding spot. You know, the, the, that's just more chance of it'll find me in the basement. Okay, then instead of... God, it's so dark. Are you hunting? What I... Did that door just move? Or are we doing this again? We're doing the thing where it was glitchy as I came around the corner. This, all these houses are so glitchy. So, see, even though you can't see the light on, there is a light on down here. What I want to do is get these lights on. I'm gonna drop an extra smudge down here. I'm gonna drop it all the way in the back so I can be hidden. Now I'm gonna grab the music box and we're gonna see what happens. I'm not even gonna try and take a photo because, again, I'm just trying to get enough hunts here to see if this is gonna be a fast ghost or not. Now I guess I don't need to be... I guess I don't need the hunts to be longer to see if it's the fast one, do I? Whatever, I'm gonna use the music box anyway just to try and get a hunt. Oh, this is the foghorn. You belong on Point Hope, dude. I'm gonna walk up here and you're, you're gonna be right on top of me. I knew it! I should have closed that door, because if he sees me, 
Still the normal speed though. At least this time I have a light on down here. Now the vehicle is even he comes in here for me. This isn't too bad of a spot to hide. It's almost like what do I do though? If he really does get all the way back here, I'm gonna smudge and then run away because I'll have another smudge. I don't Oh my god. That was awful. He came in here right at the last second. I kind of want to get that to happen again. <laughs> Actually, that was so cool. You know, these last few games, I've had some really different interactions. That's the radio up here, isn't it? God, it's so creepy. Turn that shit off, dude, and you turn on everything else. Oh my god, that shower. That's the shower in there. My EMF. My EMF. Thank you so much, little EMF, because you just saved my life. I was like, dude, my EMF is going crazy. My EMF just alerted me to that hunt. Because I was so focused on the showers and everything else. I, the only thing, I didn't hear it hunting. I just heard the beeping of the EMF, and I was like, oh my god. Now, he did come down here before, so he might be back. See, that one wasn't a cursed hunt. I don't think. Was that normal length? That had to have been normal length. See, so strange. Maybe I didn't... I think with the music box, I did, maybe I didn't use all my sanity, so it's... I used it, but I didn't it trigger a cursed hunt. That's so strange. No, I think it was normal speed that time. This is an amazing one. I think it'll be smudged, because we did smudge the ghost, so we have a second here. I'm gonna go back here and turn this off. Oh my god. Gotta go all the way back here. I've never really had a ghost mess with this bathroom. And then the drain? Oh no. What, what am I hearing? That's my... What am I hearing? Oh, that is the sink. I thought it was the EMF. <laughs> I thought it was the spirit box. That's what it was. I thought it was that. Okay. I'm gonna definitely try and get one more hunt here. Oh, you know what? <laughs> See, I'm... This is... <laughs> It's like I know everything about this game, but I forget it. The shade, it'll only hunt in a different room from you. So let's see if it hunts from the same room. I totally, see, I, I really do. Like, there's nothing you can tell me about this game that I don't know. I just forget about it in the moment. But then it just hit me, the shade. Oh, right. It'll only hunt from the same room. Or it will not hunt from the same room. Also, it just showed me where the bone was. So I really need to get a hunt here. And see if it does it from the same room. Now you, you threw that. And now you're touching stuff in here. Maybe you're roaming in here. I don't think it's smudged though. I'm gonna pick up the bone. I'm not gonna worry about photos or anything else because I, I could, I st could still be wrong here. I mean, this could be an active shade, but I'm in the same room with it, and it's not hunting. I don't know if I should stand here and see if it hunts in there come on give us a sign Z I think it has hunted from the same room though thinking about what's happened with this ghost I really do think it has hunted because I was over here and then it was hunting but maybe it hunted like in there or in here I don't think it's smudged. Give us a sign. With my breath and the dots and everything. Okay, you're over here. I do think we're in the same room. The best case scenario is it roams to a adjacent room and then hunts from there. And then that'll be what makes me think it's a shade. Honestly... I think it's a shade anyway, because it's not hunting. Now, I think one of these crucifixes can be used. But see, it's been using them, but maybe it's standing right there, because this crucifix definitely goes into the other rooms. But now the crucifixes have been used up. I'm going to turn off my headlight, I guess. I, I really need to be standing in this room, and I need to see if it hunts from in this room. <laughs> Man, 
this is what I mean. This is why I wanted to focus on just learning the ghost. And I, I, like I said, I knew I was sitting here saying like, there's not much I can do, but then it's like Oni Airball, Shade Hunt from same room, Jin turned off a breaker. So there were things that you can figure out. I don't know where that came from. I think it's a shade though. I think it's been hanging out in its room and it's not hunting. I should be low enough sanity. Yeah, see? And every single time it's not uh, been the faster twins. And also it's not been doing two things at once. It's not been doing things really like far away, but I mean that would be hard to tell anyway in a room like this. Say if, if it did something over there, the ghost could have just been over there because this room is so big. Okay, one more hunt. I, be I bet if I go downstairs it'll just start hunting. Alright, I'm not in the same room as you. Maybe you oh maybe you really are a shade, because even a shade just sometimes doesn't want to hunt. I really should be at zero sanity with everything that's happened. Okay, we we gotta get one more hunt, and if it's the same normal speed, I'm just gonna say it's a shade. And honestly, it was kind of an alright shade. But I did have to find his room with the cold. But that thermometer really does come in handy more than I thought it did. I know I'm back up here now. Come on. Walter Miller. Come on, Walter. Are you right on top of me? Where was that? I don't want to... No, it was over here. It was the shoe again, probably. Now, Z, was that on the stairs? I'm gonna smudge. Was he on the stairs and that considered it another room? That one really screws me up, because I, I don't really know. He's gonna come back down here. He knows what to look in here. But now, I actually guess he's going back up. Now, every single time, it's been the same speed. I think it was above me. I don't even think he's down here. I think the hunt's over. Okay, look. If this is the twins, it'll be a scenario where I really don't think it was twins. I think what just happened there was it was on the stairs. I think it was literally right here when it started its hunt, so it was considered on their floor. So let's just go see if it was twins, or if this is just the most trolly scenario ever. Okay, I'm banking that it was on the other floor. But God, what are the odds of that being the case? It's probably twins, and I'm just going with shade. It was a gin. So it. Oh right, because the breaker wasn't off. Oh my God. <laughs> see. I, what happened there when I was in the basement and I swear I turned on the I moved that light switch and I didn't see anything change But I guess that's because where that light switch was the light wasn't even near it So I I must have turned on the light and just didn't even notice it turn on. It's just because I know exactly what happened there Okay, well, there's two more games. So I did it is fun I was afraid like I'd get them mixed up But that was very good because in the end we had a lot of experience with nightmare there. So I'm hoping to learn even more with Nightmare. It's every time I get back into it, I gotta remember the things. It's like I know everything, but I gotta remember it. So, you, <laughs> the, the gin, I, I, the breaker, I just gotta keep the breaker straight. There's so many things you gotta remember, and that's the point of Nightmares. There's so many little details you gotta remember going back and forth with, you, with each ghost. So if you're still here, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.